So I'm Danny Lomas, and today I'm doing the Watch Shot Watch Challenge. I've been given five scenarios, I'm gonna be picking an outfit and then picking a watch to complement that fit. The Watch Shot has the widest selection of watches in the UK, so who better to team up with to be able to bring you this? You're about to board a 12-hour flight, which watch do you take with you? So for me, I'd say comfort is essential on a flight. You want something light, you want something airy. That should do, yeah. Don't really tend to wear tracksuits, you want something that's kind of floaty and easy. Bottoms, coats are quite thick. Probably won't wear jeans on a 12-hour flight. Suit trousers, you can't go wrong. Loafers. Loafers are easy, cool, chic, and then you can also, you probably end up kicking them off anywhere during the flight. So that's my outfit. Now I'm in the outfit, I can head up to the watch. And for this one, I feel there's no better watch than the Casio Full Metal. So I actually do own this watch myself. Very 80s style, lovely gold. So for me, I wear gold over silver, so it matches my accessories. Doesn't look too much as well, like it's not too flashing in your face. G-Shot's got you covered. It is your first night at the pub back in Yorkshire. What is your go-to watch? Interesting. In Yorkshire, you kind of want something a bit more like 80s casual. There's a big football scene, so I think you can't go wrong with a pair of jeans. That is the perfect jacket for the pub back in Yorkshire. Our favourite's the book, so we always go there to play pool. To be fair, half the people in book just wear trackies anyway. <laughs> Shirt, probably even say like a nice button down. It's very Yorkshire style, it's very classic menswear. So I think that'll do ya. For shoes, you could go desert boots. I think trainers are a safe bet. All reliables. I think that'd be quite a solid outfit to go to the pub for the first time back in Yorkshire. So now I'm in the outfit, it's time to pair it with a watch. I'm gonna go for the Boss Skymaster. So I feel like this is a perfect watch to take to the pub. Big face, so you can see everything, even when you've got beer goggles on. So it's a buckle strap, which is perfect for going out because you've got a bit more security. So with a brown leather strap watch, it always ages really nicely, so it gets better with every way you use it for. Feels comfortable on the wrist. It's not too big. It's not too flashy, but it's still a very lovely looking watch as well. So moving on from the pub look to... You've been invited to attend an awards ceremony. Which watch elevates and complements your look best? Ah, lovely. I think your suit is your best option. Houndstooth, red tie, black shirt. I think puppy tooth is very quintessentially British and very mod. Very 60s. That is right on my street, that. Gotta do the two-piece, 100%. Black trousers could work, but I feel like it's a bit either waiter or half a tux. I think an award ceremony, you wanna have something proper. And for shoes, gotta be a nice loafer. And I think these ones with a splash of red ties it all in lovely. I think that is your look for rear of the year. So without further ado, bang this on and we'll choose our watch. There is only one watch in there that I think is absolutely spot on for this. The Timex Easy Reader. So for me, this is absolutely spot on with this suit. It is just plain black leather strap, white face, nice little chrome bezel, no nonsense, no fuss. It really does work with the suit. It is perfect for this, and I would say, with a suit, something like this, people usually go really flashy and they think, well, if I'm gonna wear a suit, I'll need a watch that's gonna have all the bells and whistles, and it's gonna be a showstopper, and it's gotta be absolutely this, 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 and this. But I think with Easy Reader, it's such a underrated, like, icon, I guess. For number four in the Watch Shop Watch Challenge, we have, you're spending the day fixing your car. Which watch do you grab? Interesting. I quite like that one. For the outfit for it, you obviously want something that you don't mind getting kicked in. Oil, it is another battle between jeans, and cords. Cords are a bit more specific. They are a good toweling material as well if you need to just wipe your hands in a flash. So, cords are very durable, not gonna rip your crotch out straight away as soon as you bend over once in them. So, I think for tops, 
mean, a footy top could work, but then if it's an old footy top, you might not be able to get it again. Probably say polo. Maybe I haven't worn in a while, or maybe not usually a white one, but a nice easy top. Probably have to say the boots. The docks kind of, they've always been around. They're very durable. I think this is pretty spot on and pretty accurate to what I'd wear if I was fixing my car. And then if you want to go pub, you just throw a jacket over the top of that. You're ready to go, basically. So, without further ado, get into this and go choose a watch. Now I'm in the outfit, I've realised it doesn't really look like you'd be fixing cars in this. But the jacket that I came in is one that I actually do fix my car in. Thank you. This is looking more like how I'd fix my car. So when I think of fixing cars, I'm thinking of being on, under and in my Mini. I think this, just like the Mini, it's black, it's white, it's classic, it's timeless, it's small, it's cute. It's the Casio Classic. For something in its double figures, that is a classic watch. You can use it for anything, but I think fixing a car is pretty spot on for my daily life. And let's be honest, like if you're fixing a car and you're covered in oil and dirt, you just want to give it a quick scrub down. And this watch is perfect for doing something just like that. So for the fifth and final watch shop, watch challenge, outfit, watch combo of today, you've just gotten a text from a girl who's inviting you to a last minute date. What is your go-to watch? Outfit first, definitely that. No, I'm kidding. So what we'll do is, I think you go for a nice casual, you go white jeans, and then I think even merino. Yeah, that, that'll do ya. And then, shoes, it's gotta be the desert boot, hasn't it? How last minute can you get? What did that take me? 30 seconds, done. This is the day outfit, it is very turned down. You can afford to peacock with the final watch, and what better to do it with so the Citizen Calibre. We won't even go out of time, even on a leap year. Rose gold face, which I wouldn't usually go for. I'd usually go gold, but this just looks fantastic. Absolutely stunning watch. I think that is perfect for going out on a date with. With an outfit, you kind of dress it down and then you let the watch do the talking for you. It doesn't look in your face. It is just very classic. I'm Daniel Omas. This has been my Watch Shop Watch Challenge where I've chosen outfits to pair with my watches. Hope you've enjoyed. Let me know in the comments below which has been your favourite watch.